Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. It is the Earth Witch and today I am coming to you with a houseplant haul. I haven't talked about houseplants in a while, um, but that's mainly because I haven't really bought any new ones lately. But now that I've taken care of the ones that I have, some have died, some have lived, we have all learned. And um, I need to do a houseplant update, but for now this is a houseplant haul. I went houseplant shopping today. Um, as like a birthday gift to myself. My birthday was last Tuesday. So when this goes up, it'll be like a week from, yeah, whatever. Anyways, so I got one, two, three, four, five, four, kind of five houseplants. Two are the same and I'm going to show you what they are. Um, this first one I got is a lemon lime philodendron which I'm super excited about. I've been wanting to get one of these for a while now. And um, yeah, it's a tiny one. She's in a four inch pot and this was $5, $4.99. The next one I'm super excited about is this one. This is the, um, oh, I'm sorry, what is this called? I had one before. Neon Robusta Syngonia. The leaves are pink, some are green. And um, I had one of these before and it died because it was already a sick plant when I bought it and I thought I would be able to nurse it to health, which I did not. It also got spider mites and died super quick. Um, so this one I got, it's from the same nursery, but it's much healthier. The leaves are huge, huge leaves. Let me see. That's my hand. That's the leaf. It's already starting to vine. This is the same price as the other one I got, but much larger as well. Look at that leaf. They're beautiful, huge. This was, yeah, $6.99. The roots, I thought this was pretty cool. This is an aerial root. Let me see. This is an aerial root and it grew down into the pot from up there. So I was like, yo, that's dope. Um, these plants vine and I'm super excited to have this growing in my house and to get even bigger and vine. I'm gonna keep it in a sunny spot so that it can keep its large leaves and just keep doing its thing. All right, these next, I'm excited about all of these to be honest, but this one I saw, I wasn't even planning, I wasn't even looking for it or anything, but I was like, yo, I have to get this. Love this plant. This is a type of Ripsalis. I'm not sure what type, it doesn't say, but if you know, can you comment it down below and let me know. I will also do some research and look it up as well. I have a pencil Ripsalis, but this one is more of a like hanging one. I got two so I can combine them into one big plant. And um, each one of these was $3.99 for this little two inch. They are so pretty. I love with Ripsalis plants. They're just so cute and so different. They're very different. So that is my third and fourth plant. It's technically just one, one type of plant, but I have two. I'm gonna make it into a big pot. And the last one, which was a total surprise. I did not expect them to have this, and I've been wanting this plant. If you do not know, I am sort of obsessed with peperomias. I have at least like five different kinds in my house right now. And so I got a peperomia rain drop. I am so excited. Look at that leaf. This is my hand. Oh, I love big, round, waxy leaves. <laughs> I love peperomia in general. Some of them are a little curled up and bent. Oh my god, I just broke that. I wanted to straighten it. It's fine. It's fine. It was a funky leaf anyways. Um, some of them are curled up and are a little weird, but it, this was like the nicest one. It's also really tall, and this one was $15. It was $14.99. And so I got all these plants for $30, but that's including $5 off for, um, I think it was $31 in total, um, $5 off for my birthday. So that was a plus. But yeah, those are the plants I have. I'm excited to grow these. I don't think these are difficult plants at all. 
If anything, all of these are like super easy to take care of plants. They don't need super special care or anything. Just some light, some love, some water, and occasionally some food. <laughs> So I hope you enjoyed this video soon. I will be doing a plant update and another plant tour so you can see how the ones I've had have grown, how some of them aren't with us anymore, and how things have changed so far throughout the summer. I know I did one towards the beginning of the summer, now the summer is ending. It's going, well, no, today's the first day of fall. So yeah, I'll do a fall house plant tour. So I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a thumbs up, subscribe, and I will see you guys later. Peace out.